we now discuss the solution of a problem from the section algebra and the problem what we are going to discuss now is on the principle of inclusion and exclusion and this question has appeared in CSIR national eligibility test held on 16th February 2022 and it is from the section B. The problem is let S be the set consisting of N 1 less than or equal to N less than or equal to 999 and 3 divides N or 37 divides N. How many integers are there in the set S complement consisting of N 1 less than or equal to N less than or equal to 999 and N does not belong to S. And we are given four options. Option 1, 639. Option 2, 648. Option 3, 666. Option 4, 990. We are given a set S consisting of the natural numbers 1 less than or equal to N less than or equal to 9, 9, 999 wherein 3 divides N or 37 divides N. All such numbers from 1 to 99 both inclusive are there in S. And how many integers are there in the in the set S complement that is that is all those N wherein 1 less than or equal to N less than or equal to 999 N does not belong to S. That means 3 does not divide N and 37 does not divide N. So all such elements you have to find and the four options are given to you and we will now discuss the solution of the problem in detail. We are given S is a set N consisting of N 1 less than or equal to N less than or equal to 999 3 divides N or 37 divides N. We have to find the n of the number of elements in S complement where S complement is a set consisting of n 1 less than or equal to n less than or equal to 999 n does not belong to S. We have S right so all those natural numbers n from 1 to 999 both inclusive 3 divides n or 37 divides n. And this can be written as A union B where A is the set N 1 less than or equal to N less than or equal to 999 3 divides N. And the set B consisting of all those natural numbers from 1 to 999 both inclusive wherein 37 divides N. So the A union B we have written. Now N of S we want n of s. So if we find n of s then n of s complement is will be from 999 minus n of s and that will be easy to compute. n of s is equal to n of a union b. s is equal to a union b therefore n of s is equal to n of a union b. n of a union b is equal to n of a plus n of b minus n of a intersection b and this is by the principle of inclusion and exclusion where n of a the number of elements in a is equal to is equal to the greatest integer of 999 by 3 the bracket 999 by 3 and that will be 333 that is the that is the greatest integer not exceeding 999 by 3. So that is 333. N of B number of elements in B will be the bracket 999 by 37 and that will be 27. Yes. And uh, A, A intersection B. What is A intersection B? The set consisting of N 
वन लेस देन एक्वल टू एन लेस देन एक्वल टू नाइन एंड नाइनटी नाइन थ्री डिवाइड सी एन एंड एंड थर्टी सेवन डिवाइड सी एन देन व्हाट विल हाउ मेनी एलिमेंट्स आर देर इन ए इंटरसेक्शन बी एन ऑफ ए इंटरसेक्शन बी इज इक्वल टू द ब्रैकेट नाइन एंड नाइनटी नाइन बाय थ्री इनटू थर्टी सेवन व्हाई थ्री इनटू थर्टी सेवन बिकॉज थ्री एंड थर्टी सेवन आर रिलेटिवली प्राइम दैट इज द जेसीडी इज वन देवरफॉर एन ऑफ ए इंटरसेक्शन बी विल बी the gif greatest integer function of 919 by 3 into 37 and that will be 9 therefore n of s is equal to n of a plus n of b minus n of a intersection b and that is 333 plus 27 minus 9 when computed you will get 351 now n of s complement that is uh, the n of the set consisting of n 1 less than equal to n less than equal to 999 wherein n does not belong to s that will be from 999 we have to subtract n of s so so this is the one so n of s we know 351 that is 999 Minus three hundred fifty-one. That will be six hundred forty-eight. That will be n of s complement. So, let's look at our options. Our answer six hundred forty-eight is is appearing against option two. Therefore, our answer is option two. So that is the discussion of a very simple and straightforward problem from the algebra. Uh, based on the principle of inclusion and exclusion and i am sure that you have understood the solution of this problem and go on working out some more problems of the similar nature i wish you all the best thank you